hello beautiful and lovely people i welcome you all back to the channel once again if you're a returning subscriber thank you for always coming in and if you're a new subscriber thank you so so much please don't forget to subscribe to this channel turn on your post notification bell so that you can be notified anytime i post a new video and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up thank you in today's video i share with you how to make this simple jollof rice these are my ingredients I'll make sure to list them in the description box for you. To begin, I'll just go into my pot with some sunflower oil, allow this to get hot and then go in with my sausages. So the sausages, you can cut it anyhow you want it or any shape you want it. I'll be frying this for about 5 minutes and then take it out from the oil and set it aside. Next, I'll go in with my chopped onion, allow this to fry for about 4 minutes till it's translucent. Afterwards, I'll go in with my rosemary and some curry powder just to infuse the oil. Moving forward, I'll just add in my mackerel, allow the mackerel to fry for about 3 to 4 minutes. So after 4 minutes, my mackerel has fried very well. I'll just go in with my tomato paste. With this recipe, we are not using fresh tomatoes. I'll allow my tomato paste to fry for about four to five minutes I'll then go in with my grated onion and some powdered pepper allow this to fry for about eight minutes At this point, I'll add my shrimp powder, my Sankofa garlic and ginger powder. I'll add in my tuna flakes and then some salt to taste. Give it a good mix and allow this to fry for some few minutes. I'll just go in with my washed rice which I washed for about 3 times. Add a little bit of salt to taste and then allow this to toast for about 8 minutes. After then I'll go in with some water. After 8 minutes, I'll give it a good stir one more time again and then go in with some water for it to cook totally. If you are watching this video up to this point, it means you are part of this beautiful family. Please hit on the post notification bell so that you can be notified anytime I post a new video. And please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Thank you all.
this is after 10 to 12 minutes on a medium heat i'll just give it a first stir and then cover for it to cook I'll give it a second stir and allow this to cook till it's ready. Remember jollof rice you do not need to keep stirring it otherwise it is going to break or um, tear apart. Moving forward in the pot just add a little bit of oil. Allow this to heat a little bit and go in with your carrot. Allow the carrot to just fry for about 2 minutes and then go in with the rest of the vegetables. That is your green bell pepper, your onion. Just add a little bit of black pepper and seasoning. After that is done, I'll just transfer it onto my rice. Add a little bit of margarine and then give it a good mix. So guys, I nearly forgot my sausages. So I just remember and I added my sausage. So look at how beautiful our jollof, simple jollof rice is looking. I hope you're going to try this recipe and let me know in the comment section how this goes. This was really good. Trust me. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.